Okay. Oh, all right. Uh, so, uh, why am I on a roof, you ask? Well, um, it's because I have like six siblings in my house that are loud and obnoxious. And I also got kicked out of the field. The field was my second, second place to go. So, here I am now, on top of a roof. Um, it's also raining, so I'm just gonna try to make this quick before my camera gets wrecked. All right, so this summer has just ended, which truly sucks. Um, it was a pretty great summer, actually. Pretty great. I did a lot of things. A lot of things that I filmed, but it just wasn't enough to make individual movies, so I decided to make this summer recap video of all the fun things that I did. All right, at the beginning, what was, where was the beginning? Uh, hey, oh wait, I have a list of all the things I did. That way I can remember them all. My summer started and I'm going to Mexico. I went to Mexico. I went to Mexico and I built some houses for some people and I went to Knott's Berry Farm for the first time. That was a blast. I also made a movie on Mexico. Go watch it. It's called uh, my, uh, it's called, I went to Mexico, my trip to Mexico, my trip to Mexico, parentheses, mission for Mexico, M for M. You can go watch that. Take one. So after I got back from Mexico, I went to Canada. I went to Canada on a mission trip to go rebuild a camp that got like totally wrecked by a wildfire. Um, this camp, literally, you have to ride a boat to get to it. It's like on the other side of this massive lake. There's bears and meese, moose and me moose. Lots of moose. We did some like manly things, like we cleared up brush and chopped down trees and did some shirtless advertising. I, I videoed my buddies Caleb and Caden and Jonas shirtless chopping down trees. saw a bear, black bear for the first time ever. Oh, yeah. huh. That was lit. Everything went wet. Uh, learned to backflip on the ground. Yeah. I also got a snapping turtle. Got a snapping turtle, his name is Neff. Um, he eats literally everything. I like put snails in his cage and he ate the snails out of the shell. So, after that, I went to the beach. Now, before, am I focus? Before we go on this marvelous journey, adventure of ours, let's just take a moment and recognize my parking abilities. We got our line, line, van. Just kinda, I did that. It was an accident. So at the beach, I met this squirrel. I met this squirrel, yeah. Um, his name was, uh, I met the squirrel, what, what was his name? I named him, I named him, I forgot what I named that squirrel, man. I feel like a terrible friend. Anyways, that, that guy was very friendly. Like he'd come up and he'd be like, and then you just like feed him something and he's like, the squirrel is overall a nice guy. Uh, it was a day earlier than we were supposed to leave or something like that, yeah. And I had a cold, a really massive cold, it sucked. And we, I wake up in the middle of the night to like this screaming and it's my little sister and she's just like screaming her head off, it, it was terrible. And my dad's like, wake up, blub. 
everyone has the flu and everyone had the flu so we had to leave at like one in the morning and I had to drive I drove our massive white van over the mountains with everyone asleep I had no idea what I was doing so I got back and then I went to California with my family and my other family family no my cousins and grandparents so we went to California and I went to Disneyland for the first time in my life and then came the once in a lifetime solar eclipse the eclipse the eclipse was legit that was it was so cool I was gonna make like a solar eclipse video I was gonna name it uh, hippies nipples in the eclipse but I never got around to it so I guess this that kind of sparked this video sort of sort of like that You see, I live in like Central Oregon, and Central Oregon is right on the line in U in the U.S. for the solar eclipse that happened that everyone was talking about. Pretty much where I am, where I live in this beautiful area, is right in center of the moon's path. Everyone traveled here. Everyone. There were so many hippie hippie hippies in my town. So many. I saw so many nipples. It was disgusting. I'm not not good. It wasn't good. Joking. They had a big party up in the woods that, sadly, my mother would not let me attend. But uh, there were thousands. I think there was like, like there were a lot, a lot. So I decided to take this golden opportunity and go interview a bunch of them, and. I only got a couple interviews, they weren't all that into it. I mean, some were. Some others weren't. Hey, ma'am, how was your Eclipse life? It was great. It was great? Uh, yeah. Was it like super fun up there? It was like super fun up there. Super fun? Yeah. Oh, alright. Okay, well, I'll catch you later. That was incredibly rude. How rude. She's probably from California. Golly. Exactly. I just wanted to have a nice chat. Was it up there? Was it super, super fun? Oh that yeah, was it was wild, <laughs> wild. We're These guys like in dirt right now. <laughs> yeah, I see that are around you here. A I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you are, you gotta tell us. <laughs> oh yeah, it was amazing. We did yeah. wonderful things. Wonderful, wonderful things. Life things. Life things. Like mad love making and all that. <laughs> I mean, it, it was definitely deeper, uh, than, uh, was definitely uh, there. deeper than that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Once in a lifetime opportunity. Guys. Once in a lifetime. Yeah. Got up at three o'clock and climbed a mountain and watched the sunrise. That was pretty. Then I hiked another mountain with my cross country team. <laughs> so I do cross country and every year we have this cross country camp and then during the camp we go hike South Sister which is right over yonder. At the top of the mountain were thousands of butterflies. And it turns out it was like monarch migration. I'm soaking wet. It's, it's really raining up here. But that was really cool. 
I also got this mad coat. I think that's the last thing on the list. Look at this thing. This thing's so cool. It's a bomber jacket. And it is massively warm. Zip it up. So, overall this summer was a success in my opinion. Now I'm back to the school year, which kind of sucks. I, I'm not a fan. But, look how pretty it is. Look how pretty it is. Anyways, that's all. It's soaking wet out here. So I'm going to go inside, drink a bunch of hot chocolate, and then go to cross country practice and throw it all back up.